In today's IRS tax refund update, we will take a look at the latest developments, including the next round of tax refunds scheduled for release this week. We'll also recap some ongoing refund delays as we approach the three-month mark until the start of the 2025 tax season and discuss potential solutions for those still experiencing delays. New refunds The next batch of tax refunds is set to be released by the IRS on October 17th, as confirmed by tax transcripts. If you are part of this batch, you should see the refund in your direct deposit account on the posted date. However, if you chose to have your tax filing fees deducted from your refund, your refund will first be sent to your tax filing processor, who will deduct the appropriate fees before releasing the remainder to your bank. This may cause a slight delay, so it is recommended to wait five additional days before initiating a payment trace. The refund delays, as we approach the start of the 2025 tax season, there are still ongoing delays for those who filed as early as January. For most experiencing delays, the 570 and 971 codes are appearing on tax transcripts. 570 code this represents a hold on the tax return, which can happen for various reasons, including a random review of income or withholding, a review of certain tax credits being claimed, or the need for ID verification before tax processing can continue. 971 code this means the IRS has sent or will send a notice to the tax filer. Here are the common scenarios based on these codes 1. 570 and 971 codes with the same date the IRS has autocorrected a potential issue and cleared the refund for processing and release. 2. Separate dates for 570 and 971 codes the IRS is still working on the issue and the letter will inform you of the delay, often in the form of a 60-day notice. 3. Only the 570 code appears it's still in the early stages of review, and the 971 code may appear in future transcript updates. ID verification One of the top reasons for refund delays this year is ID verification. Many tax filers may not even be aware that this is causing their delay. Each year, the IRS randomly selects tax filers for ID verification to prevent fraud, and this applies even to those with no prior issues or those who have already completed verification in previous years. While the IRS is supposed to send a letter informing tax filers of the situation, it has been observed in recent years that these letters do not always reach the filers. Many only discover the issue after contacting the IRS taxpayer advocate or their congressional representative's office. It's important to know that your refund will remain on hold until ID verification is completed, which in most cases can be done online within minutes. Wage verification, another common cause of delays over the past two years, is the need for the IRS to verify the income reported on tax returns. This could be a result of a random selection or due to specific red flags raised by the IRS. In these cases, the IRS may send you a 60-day notice requesting more time to process your return or a letter from the CP05 series asking for documentation such as W-2s or 1099s to back up the income reported. In many cases, the IRS may review the income without requiring additional information unless there's a discrepancy between what you reported and what your employer reported. If you are still experiencing delays and the IRS has not provided assistance, we recommend reaching out to the IRS taxpayer advocate or your congressional representative's office for further help. Many viewers have reported getting their issues resolved after using one of these channels, especially for situations like ID verification, which won't resolve on its own. Closing, let us know in the comments section below if you are experiencing any ongoing tax issues. We'll continue monitoring the situation for future developments. Don't forget to click the thumbs up and subscribe buttons below for updates. Thanks for watching. Let's talk about an amazing opportunity. We're hosting a $1,000 giveaway. To participate, follow these four simple steps. 1. Subscribe to the 100% Financial Freedom Channel. 2. Click on the bell icon to receive notifications. 3. Like this video to support our cause. And 4. Comment I love 100% financial freedom in the comment section. We will randomly select two lucky winners and the giveaway date will be announced soon. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. We hope you found this information valuable. 100% financial freedom is here to support you in good and difficult times. Take care and have a great day. Stay tuned for our next video. Come